Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to continue working on part 15 of this house build. Let's get started. So in the previous video, we were able to uh, transfer this to twin motion and we added some materials. Now we're going to continue working on this. We're going to open the scene graph and the burger menu and then now we could just keep on adding materials uh, what I like to do is change the materials from the top right here I want it to be visual um, so maybe a different brown so I'm gonna go to quick cell surfaces and then wood plank and then let's change it from here maybe this one will be good enough and then let's scale it a bit so yeah I would just use this. I like the collar as well. And then what we could do is we could add the grass. So we could just highlight floor number three. I remember because we added this one last and then highlight them both together um, you can do that by selecting one and then using control hold it and then select the other one right click and then isolate once you isolate them let's go here vegetation paint and then let's go and add grass we could use this we could use lawn select here or let's drop this one and then select the lawn again to change density and then select this again to change diameter what we could do is we could just make it big like that so that it's easy I'm just holding it just holding until I finish gliding on to all the floors that I want to add and then after that We can now press escape and now we have some grass. You can select that grass and then from here you can see the way it looks. And then now select and then now right click, isolate off and everything will appear again. and then the trees that I'm gonna use let's go down right here so probably you could add a small tree right here just to add some and then here as well like those small trees bushes You can even add this kind of tree right here to give it some character. As you can see, it looks nice. And then from the side, from now, let's put some king palm. And then from here, we need to add them 
all together. Spread it out. And then what I want to do is change the size. So usually I I like selecting just one at a time so that I could change it change the size so now just select it here you can change the scale as uh, the the age and obviously you like to show what's going on at the back as well you want a little bit of s um, sky showing so you can um, look into that further so the further it is just maintain something like that you want this one to be showing bigger and then here as well make it small just enough to be shown on that view and eventually you, you get the idea of that so smaller and then bigger at size if it looks too much you can delete one like that to improve the view obviously the best view is will be looking like this so somewhere here I need to delete one just to improve the view and then at the back as well so you can do that just to improve the view and then play it something like that will be good and then the bounce of light later on you can prove that as well um, you can add in some cars let's add some cars right here let's use this 90 and then let's change this to a red car like that and then a bigger sedan or an SUV something like that let's change the orientation here So something like that would be good um, you could add in lights to improve the bounce of lights here um, and then add in some pot light around so you'll be able to improve how it looks and even some scones uh, our exterior lights around here and above here so that's something that uh, I will leave to you guys um, it's easy to do easy to add so you know the idea out of it um, I'm gonna try and use veneer and 
and then just decrease the that one so now let's set up the image so usually I like the image you can change the speed number three click number three and then here we could just put create one like that click on more turn this on but you could change how it is by just putting it low for now doing that so that it doesn't uh, you'll be able to see the difference the look and everything so for now what that's what I did so that you'll be able to see it in real time sun intensity you can change that ambient I like putting it up somewhere like that and then once you're happy you can then put it to high so, so that's something that at the device you don't put it in high too much um, immediately put it in low so that you'll be able to see and gauge and check it all um, and then you could be able to move around and then refresh it so that to lock it up and then in video same idea usually in videos it's hard to turn on path tracer unless you want to wait a couple of hours or um, multiple hours so the way to create video is for example you have to click here you want to move it your first scene is you you want it to move forward then just click that one if you review that and play you'll be able to see it's moving forward like that but again it's too slow so the way to do it you want it to be faster change the speed or change the seconds now it will be moving a lot faster in that span second if you want to add another one move it to the scene like that click it here new video part so this will be part two you want it to be doing this so most of the time I put where it will be and then just click for the key frame and then similar to this once we review it it will be so slow but by changing the seconds um, its default is 10 seconds so now I'm going to be it fast so to make it fast I'm gonna put it to 4 se seconds so now it will be much faster in that span and then here you'll be able to see the total um, seconds that you have accumulated here because 10 seconds is not enough to just showcase your video so you could just do more um, if you want to do a circular um, create a video like this for scene first keyframe I want the second keyframe to be looking like that so that's my second keyframe and then my third keyframe I want it to be like that so now once you review this it'd be looking like this so there's a smooth transition and it feels like there's a drone um, circulating to check your um, your house like I said, if you want to make it faster, 
change the seconds. So now it's looking like that. If you want to go up and down, something like this. Create this, go up. And then select that. And then you, you can change this to 4 again to make it fast. And then here, um, from part 2, if you notice, here in part 2, um, and then all of the part, it accompanies the settings that you created now if we create another one another keyframe or another part it adapts all the attributes or settings that you created but now I want to do this I want to do like that and then like this now I'm gonna change the settings to more so here I want to create the weather this one this one is stu still good the second click more again change the weather or the season to like that and then refresh it again and then now click here for the third part or third key um, keyframe click weather and I want it to be looking like that again go back here don't forget to refresh now if you click here it will change the season instantly And then you can even change how it looks right here. So weather again, and then let's make it rain. So now it will rain at the last part. So it looks sunny, then it started to snow, and then rain. And then even the trees are cooperating with the change of season so that's how you do this and then it will look really nice the way you will pull it pull it off the change of season in that instance will be uh, a game changer and then once you finalize everything what you need to do is just go to export click all the things that you have so if you only have one image or if you have multiple just select all this icon represent that the uh, path tracer is on and it will uh, render it with path tracer and it will take longer if you do that but it's worth it so now go here uh, for the video and then you just need to click export and you're good to go So, I believe we're done, and I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching, and hope you liked the video. Keep, please like and subscribe, and feel free to comment down below.